here at Tigenberg Mountain for the third annual Climb for the Cure. Starting off the Climb for the Cure today are the kids in the 120s. Those of you uh, here are watching, we welcome you here to Tagenberg for the third annual breast cancer awareness Find for the Cure to help uh, the Susan G. Coleman for the Cure Foundation, along with Carolyn Baldwin Breast Cancer and Research Fund. We have over 200 sleds here on the grounds today, some of them in our uh, 120 class, our youngest racers, getting things going for us here this afternoon. Now we'll uh, get on the way to the main portion of the program. If you're unfamiliar with Colonel Bill Hope Line Competition, we took a whole computer match about this time. Here's the main We're here with Tyler. What's it like to win? I just like um, going up the hill. How long have you been racing? This is my first time. Thanks, Tyler. For the final, is it going to be the cars racing all together with the focus for it? Here we go! In the middle of the race, the first half got Cody to back on the Polaris, took the power down, and as they cross the finish line, two seconds. It feels good. The slide's running really good, and it just felt really good. Congratulations. Who builds the sleds for you? This is my Uncle Dick, Quebeca. Quebeca's player, some Mohawk. Thank you. All right. Looks like we're ready. And away we go. And on the left lane, just a little body language there. Keep the sled centered up, and it's close at the top. Mark Merriman's going to the 100 class final here at the third annual Climb for the Cure to benefit breast cancer awareness here at Tigenberg. Glad you could join us here today. Working through some of the early class with a ton of racing left to do today, including the high horsepower, out of control king of the hill class is coming up later. Right now, you've got 700 is the first in the off the right lane? The answer to that question is... Yeah, baby! Looks like, uh, the... Looks like, uh, the... Gets 
Jim Wagner, the winner, 800 Pro Mod. How does the track feel here today? And is this your first win? Oh, the track is awesome. Uh, it's really smooth going up there. With these cold conditions, it's holding up real well. Really fast at the top. A little icy in the beginning. We're spinning a little bit, but we're getting hooked up and flying up there. And yeah, first win of the day. Thank you. race here as they head up towards the top of the hill. This is Jimmy Bouchard on the right one. Both riders moving at about half track as they head up towards the top of the horse race at the top. We're in the pit with Megan. What's your job here today? Well, I pretty much bring the classes around and get them ready for the races. And how are the sleds treating you? These are really good guys out here, so I'm glad to be here. Thank you. This one's going to go right. We're going to set this pair off and up the hill. Well, contest here. And at the top of the hill, who's it going to be? Let's go. 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 Stock 800. It's all been done on the way. Straight in the left lane, right in the right lane. How did it feel to race your cousin Chris? Um, it felt pretty good knowing it was a final. I was going to get at least second. I mean, I race him a lot, so we're pretty used to it. But it's fun. It's always fun every time. Thank you. What do you like about racing? I like this. I like him going fast.
and the mad scientist pulls out the win. What was it like to win the 900? Very exciting. The hill's perfect. We were a little there at the top. And, uh, my mad scientist dino sled's running perfect.